Welcome to Ray Purpose Made. One of the cooler parts of setting my own schedule means that I can create custom art furniture wherever I am. See how I take random pieces of wood and turn them into one of a kind masterpieces. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel to see my latest works. I know many families have had those giant storage displays in their living and dining room, a place to hold dishes and tchotchkes and books and family memorabilia. They go by many names. Some call them a buffet or a china cabinet or a wall unit or a break front. But whatever its name is, it is the shining star of Shaniqua and Miss Patricia's living room and the biggest project I did for them while I was in Houston. Usually when I create a project, I spend a lot of time just looking at it, seeing what are the extra special notes that I can add to it so that it is the best project it can be. Now when making this break front, I didn't have as much time. I had a hard out, I was leaving town, but I still made sure I put some special things in it that make the project even more important and even more accessible. Uh, firstly, the break front, for the break front, the lower part, the cabinet, I wanted to make sure that whenever Shaniqua and her mother move, that the movers don't lift up the cabinet and accidentally pull off the cabinet top. So I added a couple of handles on the front of both sides so that they can grasp onto that when lifting. Also, I put a little grommet hole in the back of the cabinet um, so that I can add an extension cord so that some kind of powered object can be in it, whether it's just lights or something else, they have the option for that. life I see the light and every day I'm better and late at night I feel light in every way I'm stronger I believe in you don't you believe in me I believe in you don't you believe I wanted to have something for Elijah, Shaniqua's brother, Miss Patricia's son. I wanted to, in memory of him, put his birthday, 328, at the very bottom of the bookshelf. And speaking of the bookshelf, the they have cats. And as anyone knows, cats will jump on anything tall. So, and being that this whole object is about seven feet tall, I, it was extreme risk that these cats could uh, knock it over. And even though the cats are light, you never know. So I wanted to make sure I mounted the entire bookshelf, the top part only, to the wall. This project's bookshelf is a reference, a callback to the bookshelf that I made for my friend Keisha, which was a wall-to-wall, -wall, floors to ceiling bookshelf that I did a few years ago. Except Keisha's bookshelf was all raw wood. This bookshelf is actually a honey wood stain and the raw wood. It's, it's the dark, dark color stain, stain they like. like. So what I did was went back and forth with areas that were going to be the dark stain then areas that were going to be just the raw wood and raw wood with some wood burn obviously the shelves can just be raw wood because you're going to put books and etc on top of it but i made a couple of punch boxes like keisha's project and two of the punch boxes were just the same wood color stain but then one of the punch boxes was fully wood burn with my traditional wood burn pattern so that's how some of the color and the design happened 
Thank you for watching my video. I hope you're enjoying it so far. Stick around, there's a little bit more. But I wanted to make sure you hit those like and subscribe buttons below to catch my latest content. I post twice a week, always every Monday and Thursday. And if you wanted to follow me on social media or get your very own Ray Purpose piece, you can find me on Instagram, Facebook, Etsy, and Gmail under Ray Purposed. Thank you and keep watching. Miss Patricia, how are you doing this, this afternoon? Oh, I am extremely excited. I am standing in front of a beautiful piece of furniture that I can see being part of my family's legacy forever. I'm sharing this moment in time with my daughter, who just happens to be dear, dear friends with Jose, a.k.a. Ray Purposed, who we flew on down to Houston to spend some time with us to build us custom-made furniture to make our home look like our home. We could not be more grateful. This piece is beautiful. It will serve as a buffet. There is storage underneath. There are shelves that we can use for accent pieces. We have some really special artifacts that we want to put there that have been given to us and we've had no place to showcase it. Uh, it's just been really fantastic, really fantastic experience. Um, I don't know, do you want to add anything there, Ms. Shaniqua? Uh, actually, no. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Mom got it, so. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of perfect. Absolutely. I'm stronger every way. I'm better every day. Yeah, yeah. I'm stronger. I believe I believe.